What's up? Hello. What's, What's up, guys? Joey Sounds here. What's up? And what, and what would your child do if someone pulled up with a nice car and tried to abduct them? I reached out to a few parents, and we're going to try just that. But I'm going to be using my Bumblebee car. Let's see how these children react. All right, guys, I'm on my way to this house. There's uh, three kids. I got my camera guys there set up. Got a camera on the mom and a camera on the kids. So let's see what happens. Oh, my God. That's a nice-ass neighborhood, too. Bumblebee. That's a sweet ass car. Come on. You like the car? You guys want to come for a ride in the car? It's the car from the Transformers. Sure, sure. Come on, get in. Let's go. Oh my. Oh my God. Want to sit in the front? No, no. You're not allowed to sit in the front. Oh, they know that, but they don't know not to. They know not to get. They know not to get in a stranger's. Where's, where's mom and dad? Did they say you were allowed to do this. Mom and dad didn't say you could do this. Why'd you get in the car? Should I, you want me to bring you back? What if I wasn't gonna bring you back? I'm sorry. Hold on, I'm so sorry. I don't usually stop shit like this, but they know not to get in a front seat of a car. But they don't know not to get into a fucking stranger's car. Hmm? What the fuck, man? What the fuck? All right. What are you doing? Why'd you get in that car, Brandon? Why did you get in that car? <laughs> Why are y'all smiling? That's not... Look at him. Do you know him? Look at him. Do you know him? You don't know, eh? Why'd you go in that car? Huh? What if he took you away and you wouldn't see mommy anymore? You don't You don't leave the front yard, got it? Alright? And you especially don't get in anybody's car. Okay? And you, so you should have known better. Hey, what's up, guys? Wanna go for a ride? Okay, so they ran. That's great. That is great news. That's happy. That makes me. Just ran away. Good job. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, it's the Transformers car, the Bumblebee. You guys wanna go for a ride? Someone's gonna have to get shotgun. Holy crap. It's like you got shotgun. I'm so it's fast. You guys just jumped in this car. Where's your mom and dad? They're inside, I don't see them. They know you're in the car? No. What if I wasn't gonna bring you back? No, you No shit. No, next time you don't just run in someone's car like that, all right? All right? Guys, so just uh, just don't do that again, all right? Yeah. As you can see from this video, some children are very gullible. Be sure to give your children a talk on not talking to strangers. Give this video a like and subscribe for more videos just like this. I'm Joey Salads, and be safe. I don't, um, I don't have kids now, and hopefully I don't have kids anytime soon, um, not until I'm in my 30s, that's when I plan on having children, um, but guarantee you, I promise this, quote me on this, that my children will know the basic life, like, do's and do nots, right, if, because I know there's kids out here of all ages, people of all ages, um, watch my channel. But if you don't know that person, if you've never seen that person before, right, 
Why the fuck would you? Don't, don't do that. Don't hop into nobody's car. So, I lied to you. Now, I made a video, Instagram video about this. Uh, I don't know when. It was like a couple weeks ago. Right. And. I was, I was, I was shooting a skit. And in the skit, I was a kid. Um, uh, Lil Croc. Right. Uh, I played a skit. Right. Um, I played, I played a role. As a kid. And so, for the, for the role, I had to. Excuse me. I had to dress up as a big ass kid, right? And I have the clothing to make me look like a big ass kid. But in the middle of productions, I had to go to the store, right? And the store is just right up the street, so I just walked it, right? So after I came out the store, I'm walking, and there's this guy in his car, and there's this guy, and it was another person um, in the passenger seat, right? And he literally stops and says do you need a ride to your house granted i look like a big ass big ass kid but come on man really you gonna act? i've never seen you before i do not forget faces i don't that is something i do not do so with that being said i've never seen you before we never talked before I don't know who you are, and you come out out of the cut, out of nowhere, and say, "Do you need a ride to your house, bitch? Are you serious? What the f me what the fuck is wrong with people? People is all I have to say about that. People, damn, I am so glad I am somewhat smart. I know I am so glad I know a little bit about a little bit." You know, I'm not the smartest guy in the world, world, but I do have fucking common sense to a certain extent. But I know not to go into somebody else's car if I don't know them. I learned that when I was extremely young. And I know as a grown man, um, I still don't, I still don't even do that. Even though, you know, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a, you know, I got some size on me. But I'm not just going to hop into somebody else's car who I never, ever met ever in my fucking life. Even if I met you once, I'm still not going to get, I need to feel completely comfortable before I get into your car. That's all I'm saying. Because God only knows where the hell you're going to take me. I need to feel completely comfortable, right? Hey, kids, people of all ages, if you're watching this, please think, think before you act. All right, that's all I have to say. But as always, keep cool, keep classy, and I love you. Stay happy, my family.